Hello everyone, you know some footballers enjoy a rainy day, not sure fans always feel that way, but an exciting match in prospect nonetheless. I'm Derek Ray, and delighted to have Stuart Robson sharing commentary duties with me. And we're focusing on, technically speaking, one of the best leagues in the world. I'm talking of course about La Liga. It's Barcelona, and they take on Granada. Well, Derek, as is always the case, the team that dominates midfield will be the team that controls the flow of the game. And that, for me, is the area that's key today. A match to look forward to. Barcelona kick off. And the Barcelona shape looks like this. Marc-André Ter Stegen in goal. Clément Langlais plays alongside Piquet in the middle of the defence. Sergio Busquets plays alongside Thiago in central midfield. And the main threat in attack today should be Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang. Gives it a go! And a fine stop. Well, they've started the game really brightly here, and they've looked dangerous. But that was a top-class save from the keeper. Brilliant from him. It'll be a corner. And there's the delivery. Goalkeeper's ball. It was always going to be that way. Well, I'm sure when it comes to our hosts, they don't really want to be reminded of this, but it is a fact. They have the leakiest defence in the league, Stuart. Well, I've been really disappointed with their defence. Now, hold on, Stuart. They're in here. That's great goalkeeping. Well, what a save that is. He was so alert there. But he's gone short with it. Decent position. Body on the line. putting it wide from there disappointing Escudero Gonalo passing it around looking for the goal that would put them ahead Baca as clean as a whistle that challenge Thiago Dembele De Jong here is Thiago Dembele and a textbook interception Gonalon oh great vision to the goal that puts them ahead a oh, terrific piece of goalkeeping let's see about the delivery relatively straightforward to mop up defensively Mali prevented it from going over the line gone along well, no mistake from the keeper acting decisively Let's quickly send it over to Alex because I believe there's been a goal at the Wanda Metropolitano. Yeah, it's a goal for Bilbao. It's now 1-0 with 27 minutes played. Alex keeping us right up to date. Longley. PK. Adama. De Jong. Well, they're sitting ever deeper. Moving the ball effectively. Can he put it in? No problems grabbing hold of that one. And Thiago. Well, far too much elevation there. Well, as you can see from those stats, they're just not creating enough. 
They need to play at a quicker tempo, get the ball into the danger area and get more players in the box. Make the opposition have to defend it. De Jong. Terrific block. Carlos Baca. Beautifully weighted ball. Escudero. The delivery. Now oh, too close to the goalkeeper to really pose a threat. Adama. And Obama Young now. Creative look about this. Will it happen for them? Fantastic work to thwart the danger. Well, a chance here perhaps to invigorate their aerial targets. Can he deliver it with accuracy? And the danger still on. Well, you've got to say, comfortably off target, Stuart. Yeah, that's a waste of good possession. His teammates are not happy with him, and they're letting him know. And that will do it for the first half. The two teams cannot be separated here. Stuart, what have you made of Bar... Amat? Underway then in the second half. And the two teams matching each other just about stride for stride. Obama Young deserves credit for winning the ball back. Can they trouble the opposition this time? He takes aim. And the keeper stretching to deny him. And over it comes, and he clears the danger. And after the cross, a tremendous block. OK, I think we ought to send it over to Alex Scott, because, Alex, there's been a goal in the Atletico match, I believe. Yeah, it's another goal for Bilbao. They've pulled ahead by two with 50 minutes played. Many thanks as ever, Alex. There wasn't much in that offside decision. Could have been in business. Substitution then, let's see how it affects the match. Well, the focus in recent days has been on West Ham to a large extent, and now we can say that the transfer is official, and the fans no doubt delighted, Stuart. Well, certainly a lot of focus on the boy over the last year or two, and he seems to have a bright future ahead of him. Hopefully it turns out to be a good move, and he can continue to develop his career. And Obama Young saw his pass gobbled up. Giving it a try. Really good piece of goalkeeping there. A corner will ensue. Delivering it. A deft clearance. A danger here as he runs at them. Simple stop really for Ter Stegen. Good work to win it back high up the pitch. Dangerous looking attack. Well, for power, 10 out of 10. For placement, maybe 8. Well, I think they've played really well today. But unless they take one of these chances, it will count for nothing. Just look at those stats. They need to make the breakthrough and make it quickly. Obama Young. Thiago. Going well. Oh, a good diving save. Well, just listen to these fans. They're urging their team to score here and take the lead. Keen to take it short here. An attack full of promise. Determined block.
They take it short. Makes the move to the inside. And back with Dembele. Well, really fine goalkeeping. Good diving stop. Favouring the short one. Has a go. Well, they're going to be very cross with themselves because that was a wasted opportunity. And I think it's fair to say he's had happier days in front of goal, Stuart. Well, he's been very quiet so far. He just hasn't got away from his marker. He needs to find a spark from somewhere and start testing this goalkeeper. And a goal has gone in at the Wanda Metropolitano. Alex Scott. Yeah, it's another goal for Bilbao. It was all in the build-up play for me. So many different players involved. And once the space opened up, he took his chance superbly. It's now 3-1 with... Can they forge ahead? Well, they would have done had it not been for the keeper. Well, they should be ahead now. Yes, it was a good save, Derek, but he should score from there. And it went sailing over the crossbar. Not a moment he'll want to remember. Well, apologies to our viewers for having to interrupt Alex just then. To clarify, Athletic Bilbao have scored in that match, and they're on top currently, 3-1. Well, over the top, but it will go through to the keeper. Well, this is the home of live football, and we have more action from La Liga coming up for you. It's Barcelona, and they'll be taking on Cadiz. Well, that should be a really good game between two entertaining teams in a great stadium. Wonderfully weighted pass. A very effective clearance. Jordi Alba. Well, big news I'm hearing. A penalty has been awarded in one of the other games. Alex Scott with the details. Yep, it was a penalty for Villarreal. And I think he'd be counting his blessings because it's gone off the post and it's gone in. It's now 2-1 with just under 10 minutes to go. Alex, thank you very much. And level it is in the waning moments. Can Barcelona change that situation? Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Well, decent effort, but not troubling the keeper too much. Well, they need to get the ball forward now and make something happen. These Barca fans are expecting a winner here. And we will have a couple of additional minutes at the end here. And he really read that brilliantly. So the final whistle here and a draw for Barcelona. How do you think they played? Well, that was so much better defensively.